Once all of the other campaign settings are complete, the last step is to upload your ads. Click on the Add Creative button to bring up the menu of options. There are a number of different ad formats that can be uploaded, including image banners, flash banners, and a number of rich media formats. It is also possible to use ad tags from third-party ad-serving platforms. However, this option is only available after being certified by SiteScout for ad tag access. Contact support at sitescout.com or call 888-216-3939 for more information on ad tag certification. The size of the ads you upload will depend on the inventory you have selected. 300 by 250, 728 by 90, and 160 by 600 are the most common ad sizes, but SiteScout accepts a large variety of sizes and formats. Depending on the inventory you have added to your campaign, various sizes may be available. On the Inventory tab that we used in the last step, it is possible to look at all available placements on each website. This can also be done from the Large Format Inventory tab. By ensuring that you have ad sizes to match what is available from the publisher, you will be able to maximize your reach across that website. Select Upload Creative and you will be able to search your hard drive for banner images to upload. SiteScout supports JPEG, PNG, GIF, and Flash file types up to a maximum size of 120 kilobytes. It is also possible to bulk upload a zip file of up to 10 megabytes containing multiple creatives. Once an ad has been uploaded, you have the option to rename it. SiteScout certified accounts will also have the option to provide a unique click link for that ad, as well as set a unique impression tracking URL. Unique click links and impression tracking URLs are completely optional and you can leave them blank if you don't need them. You can preview your ad to see how it will look when served online by clicking the preview button. Continue adding creatives to your campaign and when you're finished, click next step. If you don't have all your creatives ready yet, don't worry, you can always come back and add more later.